YouTube and today I'm here with Caitlin from Caitlin's Life and today we have filmed a look on these looks that we are wearing right now and um, they're kind of smoky eye Christmas themed you could wear them to your Christmas dinner you could wear them New Year's Eve they're just dramatic makeup yeah. looks and uh, yeah we just kind of had a wee chit chat and got ready with you guys so yeah we haven't went through each and every product that we used um, because it is more of just a chit chat get ready but if you do have any questions we comment down below and we will answer them for you um, and yeah so if you want to see this look then please keep watching okay so we're going to start off with our base I'm going to use the Revlon colours today which is my holy grail I'm going to use the two colours oh my god it's amazing it is amazing um, I'm using 330 natural tan and 180 sand beige. I'm using the Makeup Studio Face It Cream Foundation and Face It Light. I don't know what shade I'm going to use yet, but um, I need to figure out what shade I am because I'm. I'm like, what shade is on here? <laughs> <laughs> it looks so bad on camera. I actually have tan on my face today. Like, I need it whenever it with my mind, I'm going to get like, loads of these, like all shades, because they're quite a nice one. I know. Um, oh, the concealer. The concealer I am using number two from Makeup Studio. And I'm going to conceal the shade out of my life. Do you use concealer before your foundation? Every single time. Do you? Yeah. I never do. It's just the way I, I learned. Like, and now it's stuck with me. Like, we have to do it like that and work. So yeah. Like, it's stuck with me. I'm going to use the Kira Daily um, Hero Brush to blend my foundation in. I'm going to use the Zoeva. Oh, I don't know the name of that. Oh, the buffer. 104 buffer. I've got the one on the eight. Let me see that one. Let me see that one. Is that good? Yeah, really good. It's so quick to blend yeah. all the way. We're gonna to try to go through our base kind of quickly just so we can spend longer um like explaining through our eye look because that's what the main point of this video is, is like kind of a dramatic eye. For Christmas. Of course. And we're sitting beside the lovely Christmas tree. I'm going to use the NARS um, Radiant Creamy Concealer under my eyes in the shade Medium Custard. I wanted her this so badly. Oh, it's so good. And my friend works in Space NK, so she got me her discount. Mm -hmm. And it worked out like £14.30 or something. Instead of 20 I think it's supposed to be £22. Correct me so if I'm wrong. Good. It's really good. I really want the uh, Urban Decay Naked one. I got that for Christmas. Well, I, I have it for Christmas, but oh. um, I, I want it. like the lightest shade. I think I got the second lightest shade. I want like something really, really light. You see, my um, my MAC concealer is the lightest shade and it looks terrible on me. Really? I can't wear it going out Too because, light, yeah, see in pictures. My under eyes look so white and then like the rest of my face looks oh, so no. dark and it just looks terrible. It's okay if you, I was using it when I don't have face tan on. Mm -hmm. But when I have face tan on, it's awful. So really this is a beautiful foundation brush. I should use yeah? it. Yeah? Yeah. Like you wouldn't think it because it's so big but it is actually so beautiful. I actually have one though and I never try use it. Try it. I mean I didn't and then Ellen worked with you to try this and I did it and I was like oh my god. I used to know my hands that day because it was so quick. Yeah. Like you see that's what I find about that hero brush is it's just so so quick. Mm -hmm. I love it. Okay I'm going to set my face with the Rimmel London Stay Matte in 001 Transparent and Just a Real Technique powder brush. I am using the MIC Smooth Skin Bronzer. Can I use your beard brush? Ooh, yeah. The NARS brush. Yeah. I'm going to use a different bronzer. I'm going to use um, Makeup Studio M3. You could use the crap um, foundation. I haven't used it yet though, so it'll be really intense, but I have not known today. No, it's not too bad. Which I'm, she's yeah, well. I'm scared in case I mess up because even this brush, like I never use anything with this. No, that's true. I'll use that brush after I'm going to use the Cat D Shade and Light palette, and I am going to use the middle um, contour shade. I actually should have said under my eyes with the banana shade, or it's called Lyric, is the middle yellow one. But it kind of looks like the banana shade. Just to brighten up underneath. We're both kind of looking down over there because there's a big um, 
yeah. a big mirror down there too and I'm kind of switching between the both because I have one here too. My favourite blush right now, it's been this for ages, it's a Hot Mama by Bam. I just think it's the cutest colour ever. I love how shimmery it is. You see, I am re I'm really not into shimmery um, really? blushers, yeah. I, I tried the, this one, the Frat Boy one, and yeah. I buy stuff over this. Yeah? Because it, like, I think it's because whenever I'm my own tan, yeah. it makes me look like tanner, because it's got the gold shimmers in it. And then just adds to my highlight. Yeah, I know what you mean. You no, know, for some reason I'm just really not um, not into shimmery blushes. Mm -hmm. I'm going to use MAC Fever for my blush. Just now a Real Techniques blusher brush. I'm going on to highlight and I'm using um, a makeup atelier pigment called Melon. Um, this is an eye pigment and it is so freaking intense that you literally need to tap off every bit on, on the table if you're surface. Um, but I have fallen in love with it. I have like a habit of every time I put like a product on my face is to get my powder brush and kind of blend it all in together because mm -hmm. I'm always so scared in case it comes out too intense. You know, see it work. <laughs> see what we go and work. We're literally like glowing to like someone on the moon could see us. We wear that much <laughs> highlighter and blusher and bronzer that I'm just so heavy handed now. Especially like, because of I was too light handed and then I was going into work and like I was looking really pale in work. Like, Compared to everybody all my else. Was, yeah. So now I'm just so out of it. Well, for a highlight, I'm going to use the Becca Jaclyn Hill palette, and I'm just going to use. Um, I think I'm going to use Champagne Pop, which is the middle one. Are you going to the windows? Yeah, we're actually after we've got one more film or video to do, and then we're going to Nando's, and I love Nando's. Can I use that? Yeah, I don't want to like, do you want a different brush or do you want I'll just use this one. Is this one I used in your house? No, I didn't. I used you the Mac, the name Mac one. What colour did you use? The middle one. Yeah, I ball. want that. I so want to good. Use this. I'm going to use these two mixed. I'm going to use this last thing. Oh, isn't this so gorgeous? I absolutely love it. It makes my lip make me flutter. So, I was getting my nails done today. I got kind of white with or with gold glitter and I love them. I got them done this morning. Um, and then came straight here to oh, do some videos. I was about to dip my brow brush into the highlight palette because I'm using the mirror out of it for my brows. <laughs> I think we might just cut out this bit about brows because we probably won't be talking very much as we'll be concentrating. Yeah. <laughs> I don't remember the day. Imagine how, how big your forehead would look with no eyebrows. Like my forehead's big enough, never mind with having no eyebrows. You have such a small forehead. Yeah. yeah. With you, you. I love this one. I love Justin Bieber. Let's do this. Mm -hmm. I'll actually go right now. Yeah, so like drive down and then go shopping. Oh, oh. oh. and it's before my time do so my birthday, because it, it's on the first, and my birthday is the fourteenth. How do you feel it was on the twenty-fifth? Sick. Did you check it? Did you hear that? That was that was quite good. That was like wee harmony. Okay. Let it there. Hard, like kind of tell you what we're using, but we'll try the best of can. We can, but I can't find my brother. Just guess by colours. Did I left it down here? So we're just putting on um, our eyeshadow now, and it's, we're just going to really talk through it. Cause it's going to be hard to tell you exactly what um, shades and stuff we're using. I am using my NYC salad. <laughs> 
that I'm going. My MIC Sunny Skin Bronzer as a transition shade. I just think it's really, really nice and it's really easy blended, but it's a really warm colour too. And I am using Max Cork as a um, transition shade and it's kind of like my go-to um, transition colour. So this is our first video together and I'm actually shocked because we're with each other quite a lot. Well, apart from when we're working there. Yeah. We work far too much. We're adults with Are you adult responsibilities. Yeah, I love yeah. it. We are cute though. Um, what can I say? I can't even think about what I'm going to do. So yeah, we're doing actually a question and answer over on Caitlin's channel as well. We're going to film it after this, but they'll be going up in the same day. So look at the link down below and you will see our video on Caitlin's channel. And definitely go subscribe to Caitlin if you haven't already because her videos are amazing. Like her makeup skills oh, are stop awesome. It. They're so, so good. So definitely go over and check her out if you haven't. I mean, it's probably all already subscribed and all that but if not definitely go check her out or I'll find you I look really pale on camera so yeah I actually don't know what I'm person could I match? yeah, yeah I, I can't decide there's too much choice in front of me I can't no. go for this so we've got a few palettes out we've got the Cardi um, Bible is that how you say her second name? I never know how to say her second name we've got the Cardi Bible We've got just my C palette one. We have the Urban Decay Vice 4, and we also have my absolute holy grail palette, which is the Morphe 35O palette. Where did you order it from? I ordered it from Morphe, and I got hit with customs, and it was rather sad. Good. How much did you get to pay? In customs? Yeah. Customs charged me £11, 1p. Really? One pay. One pay left. Yeah. Um. I apparently I've heard that it's really hard to get your hands on. Yeah, I had to. I was like on a mailing list for it because I missed it the first time that it went out. I missed it, so I was on like a mailing list to get it. Because that's actually a question that I got asked quite a lot underneath my photo of this on Instagram. Is how like where did I order from and how did I get it? Um. I got it from the Morphe palette site or the Morphe brushes site. But um, I, I missed it the first time, so it was out of stock for ages. And then I went on like a mailing list, and the minute it was out again, I ordered it straight away, and then got charged customs for it. So, do you know a way that works? Really? You sell the actual brushes, don't you? Yeah. I ordered a few of the brushes um, in my friend's house in America that I'm going to be getting for Christmas. I'm being really sassy and doing a spotlight, and I never have. I, don't have I had that on today. I had a spot. Uh, done a spotlight today. Are you doing like a little one or something? I actually really like it. Although I'm not gonna do one now, I don't think. That's what I have on today when I like, first came to your house. Yeah. I am using what is it, three times? Three times. I am using like a mixture of colours. I have used this one and this one. But I probably will just add loads over and you won't even be able to see it soon. Okay, I feel so sorry for Caitlin because now that she's moved into her own house. She doesn't oh get to spend all her money on makeup anymore. I sent Karen a screenshot the other day of my bank, like that day. That made me sad, like, um, oh my oh god. Oh my god, it was sickening, like all my pay went in and it was gone. Like, all my rent. It was, it was My sad. sky bill, like I changed my sky bill, this is such boring adult talk, but I changed my sky bill to a different date now, so it comes out in the middle of the month. Not when everything nice. else comes out. Your sky is £50 a month. Mm -hmm. But that's why I ended that, because I've got sky fiber, wifi. That's seriously dear, dude. Normal Wi-Fi would work here because I live in the country. Yeah, we also were like we were when we were started recording this, we could hear the cows. That's how close Caitlin lives to the country. <laughs> it's quite funny. Okay, people in Nando's are gonna think like I'm heading out tonight because I'm gonna go so smoky here. Well, why not? That's totally an accident. But I'm just loving this palette. I knew you would love it. Have I ordered it? How uh, much was the actual palette? Like, I think it worked out like really set 16, 17 pound. That is Isn't that so good? What's this cup pigment? Do you know? What one? Do you have it in No, I can't remember. Oh my gosh, get all of my face. Isn't that amazing? I am going to bring up the Alvoma. I'm so excited right now. 
only for my these are quite crumbly because they're so, like, yeah. they're best big mints. You have to be quite careful. Yeah. No, I could feel like whenever I tried it my hand, I could tell, but like, it's because they're, they're so less. Yeah, well, that's exactly what they are. Yeah. yeah. You can only press them to a certain extent. I've got these pig I've got pigments. A couple of mac ones. I think I have this, but I can't decide what they're doing it. Is it rust or something? Oh, I don't know what it is. See, for a while though, I hate the pan powder. Really? Yeah, I hate it. Because I have oily skin, I just think it really looks so much on you. Oh my god, yes, I need it. You want to do it? Oh my god, I need that glitter. Okay, so I have found my new favourite glitter. What is this called? So beautiful. Like, oh my goodness, I am dying. Oh my gosh. Okay, BRB, dying. <laughs> dying. Holy crap. And it's a bit. And I think, see, especially for a party look, although we kind of just done whatever we really want. <laughs> or what we would do, wear on like a normal day. Glitter is like a must. Yeah. Like, I love the glitter. I have glitter right now. Yeah. yeah. If you have any questions about what we use, because we kind of use like a mixture of things, like just comment down below. Everything. Um, and I'll like we'll probably be able to tell you. Yeah, good idea. Yeah, so see if you ever wonder like what we're say we don't say what we're wearing on our lips or our crease or this or that. Um, yeah. <laughs> that was trying to get that. If you're not sure what we're wearing and we forget to mention it, comment down below and we will definitely, definitely be replying. Like even if it's Caitlin, like she'll keep an eye out for my uh, on my video um i'm up a big ass if you yeah yeah well that's true if you are wondering and she like either one of us will reply to your um comment because we will definitely be replying on this video and and the next video too if you have any questions i am using the makeup studio liquid liner okay so answer me this do you ever get a bad lash day? Like I do. do yeah. Mm -hmm. I always like well not always, but I get bad lash days and it's so annoying. Oh yeah, I'm using the Max Factor False Lash Effect mascara and I love this, especially for before like any other mascara because it's waterproof. It keeps your eyelashes curled and I always curl my eyelashes. Do you curl your eyelashes? Yeah, I forgot to wear my eyelash curl. Mm -hmm. I always curl my eyelashes. I don't know how I people put. Oh no, I always have, but I think it's because my mum always did. Um, and I kind of just yeah. say, always seen that. Yeah. But I did, and then went off, and then sort of didn't again. Now I like have to. Yeah, I don't know how people do. Okay, another thing to comment down below: How many mascaras do you use? Like three. I use three. Well, I use four because I use a different one from my bottom lash line. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Because. I bought oh, I bought this Mac one because I I loved it and I thought it looked like the lipstick. The it's it's rubbish. Really? <laughs> to, to be and that's being nice about it. The brush is tiny and it's just rubbish. So I only use it for my bottom lash line. Do you remember the Mac one? Um, it's upstairs. Is it purple? But, no, it's like a weird shape, but it's really really good. I really like it. I am going to put that glitter in my waterline. And that's oh so cool. Oh my god, I love that. Oh, um, I love that. And then I'm just going to set my waterline with a black um, eyeshadow. Just to set the cream liner. Okay, I'm actually starting to like this makeup look. I really hated it, but no. Selfies are going to be on point though. Just like going my eyes are kind of freaky. 
kind of nothing now. I cut my eyes are so dark, I'm just going to bronze up my face even more. Not that I need to, but just because I like to think I'm a drag queen. And now I for my bottom lashes. My mascara has taken me about four hours to do. Has anybody noticed this? <laughs> 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 From the other. I love your phone cover. Do you love it? Do you oh. like my phone cover? Well, it's got my dirty fingerprints on that. Lips. Okay, I'm going to use Max Whirl Lip Liner. That's a beautiful colour. It is lovely. I'm going to use a brow pencil because it's a really... It's on the floor now. <laughs> it's a really, really weird colour, but I kind of like it. And I'm going to use Velvet Teddy. And I'm going to overdraw my lips. So I'm going like to overdraw mine too. So for my lipstick, I'm going to use Dose of Colours Liquid Lipstick in Truffle. I actually just found out that these are like vegan friendly, which I really, really like because obviously a lot of companies and stuff do test on animals, which is not great for the likes of Lime Crime and um, what else? Parkday. Parkday. Where? Mac? So it's always nice when you see one that don't, one that doesn't. And that is my lip cover. And I think that's me done. Okay, so we are done our Christmas party inspired that we kind of forgot about. My lip. Mine's like Halloween or something. Yeah. <laughs> Yours is very autumn. Yeah. Mine's just like kind of. New Year's Eve. You're just kind of, yeah, you're New just Year's kind of, Year's of course, eh? Yeah. Kind of more like a Christmas date, Christmas, Christmas day, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. More like a Christmassy party, um, almost like a Christmas day makeup. I would probably do something like similar to this, although I wear too much makeup, so I would probably do anything. <laughs> um, but yeah. So yeah, if you like these type of videos, please thumbs up and comment down below because we will do more if you want. Um, and hopefully you like our makeup looks that we created today. Also, um, if you want to know anything that we used on our face, please comment down below and we will definitely get back to you on that. And don't forget to pop over to Caitlin's channel to watch our other video. It's a question and answer and we answer all your guys' questions. So yeah, thank you so much, so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Bye! Bye!